The Mikoyan Gurevich MIG-31, known by the NATO reporting name, Foxhound, is one of the most advanced and formidable interceptor aircraft ever developed by the Soviet Union. Introduced in the late 1970s, it was designed to replace the MiG-25 inches Foxbat, and provide long-range, high-speed air defense against strategic bombers, cruise missiles, and reconnaissance aircraft. The MiG-31's primary role was to patrol vast areas of Soviet airspace, especially over the Arctic and remote regions where ground-based radar coverage was limited. Its impressive capabilities made it a cornerstone of Soviet and later Russian air defense for decades. The MiG-31 is notable for its powerful twin D-30F6 afterburning turbofan engines, which allow it to reach speeds of Mach 2.83 and cruise supersonically for extended periods. Unlike many other high-speed aircraft, the MiG-31 can sustain supersonic speeds at low altitude, giving it a significant advantage in intercept missions. Its design emphasizes durability and high performance, with a reinforced airframe capable of withstanding extreme temperatures and stresses at high speeds. This aircraft is also among the first in the world to feature a phased array radar system, the Zaslon radar, which allowed it to track multiple targets simultaneously at great distances. This radar could detect aircraft up to 200 kilometers away and guide long-range missiles to intercept them, making the MIG-31 one of the most capable interceptors of its time. One of the most unique features of the MIG-31 is its ability to operate in coordinated teams. Four MiG-31s could link their radars together to cover a massive area of airspace, effectively functioning as an airborne early warning system. This allowed them to provide air defense over regions far from radar stations, especially in the northern borders of the Soviet Union. In addition to intercepting high-speed bombers, the aircraft was also tasked with destroying low-flying cruise missiles, a role that required exceptional radar and missile performance. Its primary armament included the R-33 long-range air-to-air missile, comparable to the American AIM-54 Phoenix used by the F-14 Tomcat. Over time, upgrades introduced newer missiles like the R-37, which further extended its reach and precision. The MiG-31 was built as a two-seat aircraft, with the pilot in the front and the weapons systems officer in the rear cockpit. This design allowed the crew to divide the workload during complex interception missions. The aircraft's range was another strong feature, with the ability to patrol for long hours thanks to its large internal fuel capacity and compatibility with aerial refueling. With these capabilities, the MiG-31 became a vital element of the Soviet Union's defensive strategy during the Cold War, particularly against American bombers and spy planes that threatened its airspace. Even today, the MiG-31 remains in service with the Russian Air Force, having undergone several modernizations. The MiG-31BM variant is equipped with advanced avionics, modern radar, and improved weapons systems, ensuring it remains relevant in modern aerial warfare. Its unmatched combination of speed, range, and radar capabilities continues to make it one of the world's most powerful interceptors. The MiG-31 stands as a testament to Soviet engineering, a machine built not only for speed but also for endurance, precision, and dominance in the skies.